Hello everyone, my name is Richard and I'd like to show you a simple Python script I wrote called Abebus. Abebus will take any given file or files as input and parse those files for valid IPv4 addresses, uh, ignoring RFC 1918 addresses, and it will provide GeoIP information data for any of those found addresses. Uh, it uses ipinfo.io services to do so. The script is available at github.com slash 13 cubed. Again, it's called Abebus. If we look at it here, we'll see a, a little readme file that uh, provides some basic information on how to use it. It's super simple. So let's go ahead and uh, do a demo. On the desktop here, I've got a sample email header, and I've got a sample.txt file, which contains on the first three lines some RFC 1918 addresses, which should be ignored because obviously we can't provide GOIP location data for those. An invalid IP address um, on the uh, fifth line, we have what I call a CSI cyber IP address, which is just nonsense. And on the last two lines, we've got some random text with IP addresses uh, therein. So we'll go ahead and run a Bebus against header.txt, which is a very common use. In fact, this is the reason why I actually wrote the script to parse email headers and, and look for uh, things like X originating IP or various other things that would have IP addresses that I'd want to pull out. And we can see that it's provided for us, of course, the IP address, the host name if it's available, the country, region, city, postal code, if that's applicable, latitude, longitude, and the autonomous system number associated with the IP address. We'll run Abebus again against sample.txt, and we'll see that it ignores the uh, 1918 addresses and finds two valid IP addresses uh, for which it can obtain GeoIP location data. And there's the data. If we look at the options available for Abebus, we'll see that we can sort the addresses ascending by first octet, which may make it more readable if you're looking through quite a few of them. And we can also write it, instead of standard out, we can write it to a CSV file. So let's go ahead and uh, run it against both of the text files and use the sort option. And we'll see it finds all of the IP addresses we just saw and sorts it by the first octet, 817, 136, 192, and 209. Now let's go ahead and write it to test.csv, which should appear over here on the desktop. And here we go, here's test.csv. And if we preview that file, we'll see a nice CSV output, which is very clean and easy to read with all of the found data here. So again, the script is available at github.com slash 13 cube. It actually works with Python 2 or Python 3. Um, and hopefully you'll find it useful. Feel free to uh, fork it if you'd like and uh, change it as you see fit. But uh, hopefully this is uh, of some use to the InfoSec community. And uh, thanks a lot.